appetite for Ghana's petroleum industry has waned significantly since the last petroleum agreement was awarded to Exxon Mobil, who eventually exited for undisclosed reasons. Ghana launched its first licensing round in 2018, which many thought was the beginning of a transparent licensing regime. However, the licensing process showed significant flaws which have been largely acknowledged by the Ministry of Energy. After initiating the competitive bidding process, the government set, set a parallel direct negotiation process which discouraged participation in the competitive process. However, three companies stayed with their process and two blocks were won by ENI and first EMP Limited. Unfortunately, negotiations have remained inconclusive to date. The recent information is that the government has decided to truncate the licensing round and to engage companies in direct negotiation. While the government failed to negotiate and conclude negotiations on the blocks won through the open competitive bid round, it embarked on roadshows to attract investments. Between 2009 and 2023, the Ministry and the Petroleum Commission attended 21 conferences and roadshows in America, Europe, and Asia for the purpose of attracting investors. However, there doesn't seem to have been any positive results 